Number 49, dry air is 78.1% nitrogen. What is the partial pressure of nitrogen when the atmospheric pressure is 1.01 times 10 to the fifth newtons per meter square? First thing is just remember that this is basically saying Pascal, okay? Those are the units of Pascal. Now, if we had atmospheric air, pretend that this is a three-dimensional sphere, inside of this sphere, we're going to have about 78.1% nitrogen gas. And nitrogen gas exists as diatomic nitrogen, basically, N2. The remaining percent, most of the remaining percent is oxygen, coming in at about 21%. And then the remainders, don't worry about it. I mean, this is so close to 100%. All right, so basically, atmospheric air is mostly a majority nitrogen, and then the next runner-up is oxygen. What we remember is that if you know the total pressure of the gas, okay, and when I say the total pressure, I mean the total pressure of all the gases, of all the molecule, molecular gases that might be in this sample. We know then that if I want to find just the pressure of nitrogen itself, that it is related to then the percent of nitrogen in that sample. Okay, in other words, right, you might remember this formula that the partial pressure of, let's say, N2 or a certain gas will be equal to the fraction, the fraction of that gas, so of N2, in the mixture, multiplied then by the total overall pressure. Okay, so this problem is relatively then straightforward, that the partial pressure of N2 will be equal to the fraction of N2. Now, they told us a percent, okay, but we know how to... When I say fraction, you can also uh, think about it as decimal. All right, it doesn't matter. Um, so this would just be 0.781. You know, you're converting percents to decimals here. That should be straightforward. And then the total pressure was, as they mentioned, 1.01 times 10 to the fifth. And voila, we're going to calculate this simply. So we have 0.781 multiplied by 1.01 times 10 to the fifth. And we get an answer of about 7.8 eight or so, or 7.89, I guess, considering rounding, times 10 to the third, fourth, and that's in Pascal. So this would then be the pressure of the nitrogen component of the overall atmospheric gas. Guys, thanks for tuning in. Hopefully this helped. Please help us out and subscribe. See you next time.